Next I talk about the frequency presentation. In this there is histogram presentation, there is the polygon and there is the frequency curve. In the next one I will talk about the ogive, but let me talk about these three. Histogram is in fact two dimensional class interval kind of presentation and in this what matters is the height of the bar that indicates the rise or indicates the fall. But this is another thing which tells about the midpoint which comes is, called, is the calculation of mode also. Next is the polygon. Polygon is in fact a plane which is bounded by straight line. This can be drawn with the histogram and without the histogram. And then we have the frequency curve. Frequency curve is the representation, presentation of the data with the free hand on the polygon that we have. Now let me draw this. Now here what I am talking of, for example say the earning or the wages of the laborers, it will be 20 of them earn 44.5, right. And here the presentation that we have to do is next what we will do is 30 of them earn say or 40 of them earn 49.5. 54.5 here the earning is of say 50 people, 60 people earn or 70 people earn we say within the point of 59.5. This becomes a histogram. There is no space in between and the class interval which is taken is equal 44.5, 49.5, 54.5, 59.5 and here we now the same as I said this can be changed into a polygon. It can be without it also but a simple polygon if I am drawing, I draw from here and I pick up like this. And if I have to make it a frequency curve, what is it? It will be that I am just drawing it in a free hand. So, it will be, this is how it is done. This is the presentation of histogram, polygon and the frequency curve. This in fact tells about the data presentation which we have to do through the frequency method.